Hi, welcome to Time to Craft with Sylvia. I'm Sylvia. Today, what we're going to do is make turtles out of terracotta pots. So I have four of these little pots and one of the saucers and um, just uh, foam um, balls. I got these ones at Michael's and the pots. I found this one at um, Walmart and these at um, Big Lots. And then we have paint. We have green and black. We have some white and we have a little um, gold shimmer. So what we're going to do is first we're going to paint um, the top because this one we needed to dry so we can put the squares on or the, the shapes of the turtles back. So let's just get this painted all green. You can hear my granddaughter in the background. <laughs> okay, so we just paint this all over. It looks like it's going to need a couple of coats. Would you make a coat? A turtle. Uh-oh, there goes my doggy. Oh, shh. Okay. So this is going to need a couple of coats on it. Okay, so now I've got the four pots. Well, this one's almost painted. You really don't need to go all the way up to the top or do the bottom because they're not going to show. Um, but you want to get a good coating over it. And I'm just pouring the paint right on it. And... Um, kids outside with the dog. Okay, so um, let's get this. You want the rim at least painted really good because those are going to be his little feet and you're going to see those. So that looks good. Now, since I still have paint on the brush, why not go up? Okay, so let that dry and let me see about See about his shell. Oh, I know what else I need to paint. So this is almost done. Just put it up here for now and I can dry it. But while that's still drying, we can get one of the foam balls out. So that's going to be a little plate. Um, and the size of this one is 2.4 inches. I don't know if he's too small or he's just going to have a little head. Oops. Okay, what can I do? Let me get something. I know what. I'll stick him with this. There we go. Okay. I have a feeling this is going to soak it up. Um. <laughs> Uh, the kids are out there with the dog and he's running around and they're laughing. Okay. this covered and then he's this is going to have to dry so we can paint his little face you know if you don't have the styrofoam balls you can use anything that's round um, an old baseball um, anything an ornament that might break though, but baseball would be good. Okay. All right. 
this looks pretty good. Um, okay, now let's put that in there. Let's see, how am I going to hold this? We will get stick this in something over here. Oh, there we go. That works. I just stuck it in an old bottle. <laughs> okay, well that's drying. Let's see, let's put, let's put these out of the way. And you can put this. Oh, just almost let's help it along. We can get the heat gun. Is it plugged in? Yes it is. If you don't have a heat gun, you can use a blow dryer. Um, and you don't want to keep it on one spot the whole time because it'll get really hot and you don't want to crack it. good and yes my hands are all covered with paint but that's okay it's only paint it washes off all right so we're done with the black I mean I don't know my colors with the green and now we're gonna try to make shapes for his back and this is a gold shimmer I got this one at um, Michael's. Let's see. Okay. Oh, heavens. We'll just do it that way. Okay. Um, hmm. I guess let's just see what we come up with. I guess I'll start in the middle. Oh, what kind of shape shall I make? I don't know the name of that shape, but it's a shape. And this doesn't have to be perfect. If you don't like it, you can always just paint right over it again. And they don't all have to be the same size. Just, this one just seems to be getting bigger and bigger because I'm trying to make it look like something, but oh well. Okay, and now let's see. You can make some big, some small, all different sizes, because turtles have all different shapes and sizes on their backs. At least I think they do. I really don't know. But this turtle's going to have different shapes and sizes. Oh, I don't know if you can hear my other dog. He's crying because he's not out there for a walk. He was earlier. He went first and now he wants to go again because the other one's out there so he's just gonna cry Oops. oh poor baby he's crying like a little baby hmm. I guess you can make it better if you Use the end of it instead of trying to do it flat. Live and learn. Okay. All right, let me get some more of these painted. Okay, so I'm almost done with it here. Let's get it a little bit more. 
And you can't see it, huh? Look at it. Isn't that so cool? That's the shimmer. And it's all the way around the edges. And no two shapes are the same because, hey, it's a turtle. There we go. So, let's put that down. Now, what we need to do is check on our head. And he still looks wet. We'll give him a little bit more time. So what we're going to do is paint his toenails. Okay. So we just need to do it on two of them. We'll have these two up front. And let's see, where did my... Oh, here it is. There's my black. Okay, I guess we'll use this one. Shake it up. I haven't used it in a while. Okay. All right, sorry. Kids are running up and down the street. <laughs> All right. So I can see more. Oh. oh, that's no good. Let's put it that way. Okay. So this brush I want. Hmm. We'll use the smaller one. Okay, so we're going to give him, I don't know, maybe just three toes on each. I don't know how many toes a turtle has, so I'm guessing. Um, let's see. There's one, and let me get a couple more. Let's see. Hmm. Not much paint in that lip. Okay, number two. What's bigger than the other? Oh, well, maybe that's his big toe. <laughs> okay. And number three. Oh, this guy turned out to be big, too. Hmm. Maybe I should make the middle one bigger, too. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, that one's bigger than all of them. <laughs> Oh well, uh, make these guys a little bit bigger, and it doesn't have to be perfect. Because if it was perfect, nobody would think you made it. Okay, there's his three little toes, and now let me do one on this one. About what size are those guys? Um, one, two, And three. Well, that guy turned out a little pointy. Let's see if I can fix him. Okay. And we got three toes. Oh, I was way over here, huh? You can't even see what I was doing. Sorry about that. There we go. That's number three for that guy. Um, let's check. 
check this. It's still wet. Let's try the heat gun. Some spots are good enough. Okay, what we gotta do is I need another brush. Let's see. Uh, let's do this one. Okay, we need the whites of his eyes. And we got a shimmer for that. And I don't have very much in it. Oh, well. This is fun. Okay. The whites of his eyes are going to sparkle. Let's hope it works on this. Where's the dry spot? Over here. Um. Hmm. Okay, that's going to be glued like that so we'll bring his eyeballs oops sorry i keep going over there don't know if this one is going to work you might have to go to regular white when i do that do regular white first yeah because that's not really looking too white so let me get my white paint. Okay, here's my white. Some white. It's coming out green. The green is coming off because I didn't let him dry enough. That's all right. We'll just put a lot of paint on it. See his eyeballs. Guess it's gonna look like he's got green eyes. The green eyed turtle. Okay. I've got it on here pretty thick so we can um so you can see it. Alright. That over there. Where's my glue gun? Not my glue gun, my heat gun. Oops, my stand fell off. That's okay. Just get it. Get back over here. Alright. Yeah, he's still wet. Um, let's see. Let's try enough there so I can do his his mouth. Let's 
Send it with a lid. Okay. It's the black one. I'm going to try to see where his face is. Okay. He's going to have a big smile. I'm going to try to give him a big smile. I didn't want it that thick, but that's okay. of his mouth. See him so far? Isn't he cute? Now as soon as the white dries, I can put his eyeballs in there. So let's leave him over there for now. Save that brush. And what we're going to do is put the, start putting this guy together. So these are his front. So I'm going to pick him up. Let's see. For that. There's one foot. Even. There's the other guy. Um, and these are going to be back here. And I'm going to use the glue gun and the E, um, I screwed them up a little bit, the E6000. The E6000 is so, um, it's a permanent hold, and the glue gun is so it will stay, um, it'll dry faster than this guy. And I can't open it. Hold on, I've got to get somebody to open it. Okay, I got it opened. Well, I didn't get it open. I had to have my son get it open. And he had to use pliers. I guess I didn't clean it when I closed it last time. Oh, well. Okay, so we're going to put a lot of this around. Around here. And on the other guy. And when you use this glue, you need the window open. 